In case you're wondering what it will look like when you come into church tomorrow, this is it. Hopefully there'll be a few more people here than this, but as you can see, we have taped off some of the pews, every other pew. We have put bulletins in the pews, so all you need to do is come in and sit down. If you have more people with you than there are bulletins, check back with the ushers and they'll be happy to give you more. If you prefer a large print bulletin, you can ask for that. You see that we do have communion set up and we will explain how communion will work when you are here. We do ask that you wear a mask when you come to worship. Please know that when you come in through the doors of the narthex, uh, our volunteers will take your temperature with a no-touch thermometer and ask you to use some hand sanitizer and make sure that you have a mask. We do have masks available for those who do not have any, so don't stay away from worship just because you don't have a mask. I'm going to go over here and let you see what it will look like when you walk in. This is coming in from the north side by the parking lot. The table will be here staffed by uh, one of our own who will take your temperature with a touchless thermometer. Here's one actually. Don't tell Rhonda I touched it. This thing is wonderful. Just like that. 97.6, I'm cleared to come into worship. Just like that. Didn't even have to touch my own forehead. Extra masks are available. A squirt of hand sanitizer and you'll be on your way into church. We look forward to seeing you. Let's see. And I'm learning about my camera. I bet I'm going to be upside down, turned around. There we go. Okay, we are set to go. Can't wait to see you tomorrow. And please remember, if you're not feeling well, if you have a fever, if you have a cough, or if you're in the risk groups and you're concerned about coming to worship, it's okay then to stay home and watch the video. Hope we have a great video for you after the service. Take care.